It's one of the largest white collar criminal cases ever in Hawaii. And today, the woman at the center of it all changed her plea to no contest. But at 70 years old, how much time will Lola Amarin spend in prison for stealing millions of dollars? Nikki Schenfeld follows up. For more than 30 years, Lola Amarin worked as a senior accountant for ARC Hawaii. A nonprofit that serves people with disabilities. In December, Lola Amarin pled not guilty to multiple charges of theft, computer fraud, money laundering, and tax evasion. Prosecutors say she stole nearly $7 million to pay for a lavish lifestyle, using the money to buy five homes, fund lavish vacations, cars, expensive home renovations, and on family members. Adding that she spent $50,000 a month on credit card bills for a period of 10 years. But prosecutors believe she stole more than they could prove. I'm confident that the losses exceeded $8 million at least. Uh, we just didn't have enough bank records to charge an extra million dollars, but it's because the, the law doesn't require a financial institution to keep records beyond seven years. Amarin's husband, Albert, who was also charged with tax evasion crimes, also pled no contest. Every one of us has been affected by this, and we've gone through lots of emotions. And so what I tell our staff, which is our family, is keep doing what you do. As for whether ARC Hawaii will get back any of the money Amarin stole? We're going to have a restitution order for them. They can be filed as a civil judgment. They can um, attempt to collect on that restitution order just like a civil judgment. They're never going to collect um, even a quarter of what was stolen. Amarin faces up to 111 years in prison. Her husband, Albert, up to 41 years when they're sentenced in August. Nikki Schoenfeld, KHON2 News.